everybody. Yeah. Hello, welcome to another episode of Daddy Does Dalaman. I'm in Dalaman. We are in this Turkish market. Uh, it's a special market that's come to Dalaman. I'm not quite sure the occasion. I know it coincides with Amari. Hello, Amari. I know it coincides with Amari being on half term. But here we have sampled. Um, I'm not quite sure what the name is. Um, but it's like a candy gloss. And this is how they make it over here. And it's sweet, it's, it's got a candy floss texture, it's very stringy, it's very sweet, it tastes chocolate cell, which means delicious. Um, I just wanted to share with you guys how it's being made. Catch me for another episode of Deli Does Dynamite. See you on the other side. Hello, welcome to another episode. I'm sorry I missed showing you guys how they make this wonderful dish and the Turks don't waste anything flour that's left over that needs to be used they'll have a little store set up and they make these wonderful balls that are covered with some type of honey and syrup and they're completely free and the Turkish people gather around and help themselves it's really wonderful what they do here I'm gonna go ahead and try one smells absolutely delicious Smells like a donut. My mouth is watering once again. Every time I make these videos, my mouth waters. I'm gonna have a taste. Absolutely beautiful. I love this country. Catch you in another episode. Hello, welcome to another episode of Denny Does Dalaman. I haven't checked in with you guys for a while. Sorry about that. Listen, today we're in Sonra Park in Dalaman. Dalaman, such a lively uh, town. Really busy, so full of people. I'm here eating some naughtiness, guys. This is a Turkish pide. And a Turkish pide normally looks like a torpedo, but they sliced it up and they made it all very pretty for me today. This has got egg, sukuk, which is sausage and cheese. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a taste and tell you what it's like. Well, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I have this all the time. <laughs> It's delicious. So I'm going to sign up and get eaten. Catch me in another episode of Delhi Does Dollar Man. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Delhi Does Dollar Man. Now, we spoke last time about the Turkish tradition out here in Turkey, tradition out here in Turkey, where your neighbors will bring you over something to eat in a bowl, and you have to make sure you bring that same bowl back with something in it. Today, our Turkish neighbors have blessed us with this wonderful stew. Now, the lady said to me it's called shishnek, or I, I think that's what it's called. Um, so we tried to do some research on the internet, and all we can find was a Lebanese version. So I don't know if it's a, Leban a Lebanese uh, recipe. I, I'm not sure, but let's have a little look at this beautiful, beautiful dish. Now, you know, straight away you can see these lovely green beans. And I'm gonna get down and smell it. Mmm, it smells rich. It smells hot. I can see lovely bits of meat in there. I can see onions. Ah, oh, it just looks really full bodied. So I'm gonna go ahead and take a taste and tell you what I think. And make sure I get some meat, some of the green beans, and that lovely sauce. And I need to tell you at this stage, my mouth is starting to water. Mmm. Mmm. It's obviously something that's been stewed. The meat is very soft. And I'm getting so many flavors. My mouth is just bursting with flavors. I can taste paprika. I can taste red pepper, I'm sure. I can taste a bit of cumin. Um, again, guys, I'm not really sure what the name of this dish is. But it's delicious, so I'm going to go ahead and tuck in. Catch me in another episode of Delhi Does Dalaman. Hello, guys, welcome to another episode. And with my friend today, Selchuk, <laughs> we are making minimum. Come have a look. Some minimum tomatoes, onions, egg. So the egg is 
made as if you were going to make a, a scrambled egg and it's just poured into this tomato sauce which has been simmering for a while. Um, it's got peppers in it, it's got onions, salt. Um, so this is how it looks. I wanted you guys to see how it looks preparing. Catch me on the other side when it's made and we're going to have my little taster. See you on the other side. <laughs> So here I am with the chef, Sarah Chuck, who's made this delicious meal for us, it's called Menemen. So let's have a little look, let's get close. So we get close, I could just smell flavours. And did you see how the egg has mixed with the tomato, so you've got the peppers, and there's chilli flakes in here. I didn't mention that earlier. And just look at the presentation, Sarah Chuck has just finished it off. My mouth is watering. So if it's if my if I'm speaking a little bit funny, it's because my mouth is watering. I'm gonna take a taste now. Chop gazelle in Turkey means very very nice. This smell is delicious. I can't talk anymore, guys. I'm gonna eat. See you on the other side. Hello. And welcome to part two of Delhi Does Dalaman. Now listen, guys. Our neighbors have brought. Um, I don't, I, they, they told me the Turkish name, I'm not going to repeat it because I'm not sure, but it's a mixture of a porridge, a dessert, it's got rice in it, it's got peas, it's got almonds, it's got a next peanut that I don't know what it is, and it is so sweet guys, and when I'm eating it, I feel like I'm sharing something with Mother Nature. Guys, you're not here to enjoy this. I'm going to enjoy this for you. Catch me for my next episode of Daddy Does Dalaman. And welcome to Eating in Dalaman. Now today I want to show you some of the local cuisine. If you look down here, if you like me, if you like flour and water, just look at this. Just look at the, the texture. You've got the lovely vegetables and a little bit of cheese mixed into that lovely and I'm going to go ahead and take a taste now <laughs> for all the bricks back home. <laughs> Chop gazelle. Oh, sorry. Chop gazelle. <laughs> that means delicious. That means nice. It's full of flavour. It's full of goodness. And I just feel so happy eating this. This is happy food. Catch me later for another episode of Daily Does That or Man. <laughs> Try, I'm like, can you try, try, try. Mm. try. man again. And what did I say? No, no, no. Mari does Stellerman. Let's start again, let's start again, let's prep him. Stel My name is Mari, and Mari does Stellerman. And, um, and my daddy told me to eat this porridge at the neighbor's walk. And Mari does Stellerman next in the video. And then I'm gonna try. So what's it like, Sam? Good. So have a little taste and tell me what you think. A little time. Let's go. The whole world's watching. Be professional. Mm. What do you think? Bad. I'm always at that man. Bye. This is the Mario does that man. Today we'll be trying this soup. Amazing. First, let's start with the bread. Um, the soup is amazing. The name that my mother made is egg rock soup. You see, as there's egg and it has vegetables. That's all this stuff of vegetables. We tried the bread. Let's put that there. Now let's try the thing, the soup. Oh, it made him. I love it. Amari, Amari, the gentleman, peace out.